Hey guys, Ben Thunderbird, Hey Man Fishing. Today we uh, bass fishing on some rocks. We've been catching some around rocks. Uh, the water's getting a lot better. Like I say, we've had some uh, pretty bad weather that come through here the last week or so. Muddied up the water real good, full pond, all that. And uh, the bass have been hanging right off rock piles. We're gonna see if that's still the case today. And I'm using that lipless crankbait to start off with. Stay tuned. Today we're going to continue fishing. It's October. We're throwing these, uh, these uh, lipless crankbaits. And I'll leave all that in the description. We're back at a spot that we were catching some the other day. Let's just see. Let's see if they're in here. Still. A lot of fun catching them. Uh, and what I caught the other day were spots. Uh, But they're still fun to catch. I'm gonna pick up a big bass, big black bass. All I'm doing is this is a good rocky point out here. Early morning, water temperature. Looks like the water temperature is about 75 degrees. Now this time of year, guys, you know you got that. We got some of us that like to hunt and fish, and uh, of course now, there you, there you right there. Now, you got people, it ain't, it ain't too crowded out here because you got all the ones uh, hunting. All right, he not no biggie. Uh, man, I got hooked in the finger the other day. Woo! Little. Guys, if you got high water, you can fish a little bit closer up to the bank. And then when they drop that water, you need to pull back. Because them fish are not going to be back up on that bank. They're going to be back out on these uh, piers. Try out in front of them for starters and work your way toward the toward the the bank at least that's my in my opinion I'd say I'm right every time but once that water starts dropping they're gonna pull back okay I want y'all to check something out right here on this dock some of the I guess this is uh for Halloween Pretty good. <laughs> oh, there he is right there, buddy. There he is right there. There's not no biggie. Oh, come on up here. Right up in front of that dock. And he just fell back down in that water. But that's okay. We're gonna let him go anyway, wasn't I? Alright, I got I got this little pier. Get it out here in a little bit deeper water. Let's see if we can call this. What you think? We're gonna get one here. I'm going to slow roll it across. Hopefully going to pop it. Oh, <laughs> what did we do, boys? What did we say? What did we say? And he come off with my plug. Here we go. We're going to try it again right here. Right here in front of the dock. All right, y'all witnessing this. Let it sink a little bit and run across the front of that dock. Oh, man. 
we got us a good one boys that worked that worked right there look at him just keep him over here let's see if we can get him up here on the boat in front of the dock here we go oh. how about that did we call that right you what Oh. Oh. There we go. Right, sit right down beside here. I want to try. Got docks, hit them under them, side of them. Fish will hold up on them. Hey, ooh, when I didn't even know it, it got come right up here in front of me. Ooh, how about that? How about that? Okay. It's a bass there. guys we had a good day uh a good morning we ended up catching uh the bass mainly around uh, the docks up out in front of the docks um one or two there on the rocks but they seemed to come off the rocks and they moved up on around the, uh, those dock areas uh, wasn't no size to them but it was fun catching if you like the uh, content hit that uh, subscribe button and um Got quite a few uh, episodes coming ahead of me with some crappy fishing. So until next time, God bless all of you and have a great week.